It's almost time to start shopping for your Christmas groceries. Unfortunately for us, though, inflation has played havoc this year and that has resulted in continuous hiking of household goods. Let's take a look at what some of the three items that have experienced the greatest shocks have been. Nick Anderson does that for us. Things are expensive and there's no way around it. The real problem is just how much more expensive things have become over the last year or so. While the Ukraine-Russia war has seen prices of certain items and fuels spike around the world, the faltering SA economy has left South Africans feeling even more pain in their pockets. This week, Status A released the latest consumer price inflation figures. They make for grim reading. Over the course of the last year, Air travel prices have increased by a whopping 36%. In terms of overall increases, diesel leads the way. A litre is now 51% more expensive than it was a year ago. The price of onions, salad dressing and fruit have all also seen a 6% or higher price increase between September and October. And if you're hoping to feed your sweet tooth this festive season, there's more bad news. Cake flour saw a yearly total price increase of 33%, while ice cream is now 25% more expensive too. So how is anyone expected to cope? According to Debt Rescue SA CEO Annalene van der Poel, constant crippling increases have left many feeling hopeless. So that has had such an impact on your living side. And then on the other side, they've had the other impact of the interest rates increases. And that means your debt has just become so much more expensive. So the juggling act has become almost impossible. Consumers have made changes to their budgets as far as they can. They've revised living expenses. And we know one of our major banks released a couple of months ago to say that five days after um, salaries are in the bank, there's no money left. The Reserve Bank also brought bad news this past week. A 75 basis point hike in the repo rate means South Africans won't just be paying more on flour and salad dressing. They'll be paying even more each month on their car and bond too. For Newsroom Africa on Channel 405, I'm Nick Anderson in Johannesburg.